butterflies, it's Jules. Welcome or welcome back to my channel. So for today's video, I am going to be giving you guys some tips and tricks on to getting the items that are going to come on the Valentine's Day update. In the Valentine's Day update, I mean. And I made this video because I really want to help you guys, um, the, especially the players that are new to this game and want to get rich in Royal High. I'm going to give you guys some tips and tricks on to getting the Valentine's Day items, etc. Because I know that Royal High is really hard to play nowadays because there's just so many items and everything is so expensive. So hopefully this video helps you guys out because I really want to help you guys out and I'm probably going to be doing a lot more tips and tricks videos in the future so yeah let's get started guys i don't know what happened to my neck <laughs> The first thing I think that is really helpful is checking the castle events, which is always going to be in the beginning screen, I guess, right when you get into Royal High. This is a screen that you'll see, and the castle events give you a lot of information and tea that occurs in Royal High, so the Valentine update is coming soon, end of January, beginning of February. Also still working on the new school, lol. It's turning out amazing. Thank you for your undying patience and support. I love you. So I'm I'm not really sure who wrote this. Maybe Barbie, maybe Callan, maybe Vionchi, who knows? But the Valentine's Day update is coming at the end of January and the beginning of February. And January is almost ending, so I mean the Valentine's Day update can come anytime now and I'm really excited for it. So yeah, let's go back into Divinia. So I think the second thing you guys should do is go to your cell phone and press this button and you guys will see all your daily missions that you guys should do because it, it gives you a lot of diamonds for free and you guys can do this daily and it helps you guys a lot so first off go to the fountain of dreams or just in divinia normally you guys can press a button here and it would teleport you directly to the place where you need to do your daily stuff so the fountain of dreams you guys can get a halo or diamonds or xp from this which is really really cool um and the lucky spin wheel helps you guys a lot as well which is that earth again you guys can press a button here and teleport and the lucky spin wheel can either give you diamonds or an item which is also amazing because it's a free item or give you death which just basically just spawns you respawns you but you guys won't lose any of the items that you already have so don't you guys worry and the most important part is the computer login i cannot stress this enough it is so important because you guys can do this daily and the more days that you log in you guys get a streak and you guys can get a lot of diamonds on day 50 you guys can get 5,000 diamonds on day 50 and i believe day 70 i believe as well which is also really helpful because 5,000 diamonds is a lot and if you guys do it daily you guys can get up to 1,000 diamonds which is also a lot and while you're at the apartments doing the computer login you guys can also sleep which gives you energy and levels you up and when you get to level 70 five you guys can go to the trading hub which is also really really helpful i wish you guys the trading hub is right there so speaking of the trading hub trading is also an amazing way to get diamonds in royal high especially when you have duplicates um especially when you guys have seasonal duplicates because seasonal duplicates can give you guys profit so whether that's accessories and items from christmas um easter new year's valentine's day um saint patrick's day just those updates the accessories from those updates you guys can make profit because normally when they sell those items during the holiday they sell it for a specific price but after that holiday is done those items don't sell anymore and you guys can sell your duplicates of those items in the trading hub and sell them for more so for example if i have the sparkly heart hoop earrings um they're one thousand five hundred dollars diamonds and <laughs> If you guys go to a trading hub and you guys have a duplicate of it, you guys can sell it for 2000 which is amazing because you guys get an extra 500 diamonds, which is really helpful, especially when you're just starting Royal High and you guys have duplicates. It's really helpful. But um, 
a problem for me so whenever I go to the trading hub I see someone's amazing shop and I just spend a lot of diamonds on their shop which isn't a bad thing but it is bad when you're trying to save up diamonds for new updates so I mean you guys just have to be careful and have self-control whenever you're in the trading hub and don't forget that scammers are in the trading hub so you guys have to be really really careful about who you're trading with do not cross trade and do not trade first or anything so i just want to give you guys a reminder i want to keep you guys this account safe the fourth thing i want to talk about is um the shop and the valentine's day accessories i calculated all of these and they're a hundred and eighty thousand diamonds <gasps> Oh my gosh, that is a lot of diamonds. I I can't believe it. Um, but I think that you guys should only get the items that you guys really want from the shop, I think, first before getting any of the other items. Um, I think you guys should get the items that you guys really, really want because... That way you guys get the items that you really want and then next year you guys can get the items that you least want or just like other items that you also want but not as much and you guys can also check the trading hub to see if people are selling it um when the update leaves so that it's also amazing and speaking of the valentine's day accessories i want to talk about the valentine's day sets which there is Val darling valentina monchetti and there might be a new set but i'll talk about that at the end of the video so yes sets are really expensive they're like 100k or more but i think you guys should get the older sets first because those sets might actually leave the game so i think that is also really really helpful if you guys want to do that or if you guys really want the new sets you guys can get the new sets first and there might there's a big chance that people are selling the older sets for cheaper in the trading hub so it really depends on what set you guys really want um i recommend getting the items that you guys really really want first especially when you're just starting out in royal high i think that's really helpful so that is my um tip for you guys um the fifth thing i want to talk about is diamond farming and guys i will be making a diamond farming routine really really soon to help you guys out because i know there's a lot of you guys that need a diamond farming routine and mine works really amazing you guys can just check out my diamonds i do have a lot and a diamond farming routine really helps me out so i recommend going to royal high the new campus because you guys can get a lot of diamonds from it there's a lot of amazing diamonds there so yeah again diamond farming routine it's gonna come out soon hopefully but i recommend going here and do a day of royal high because that can give you up to i would say without gaming passes five thousand diamonds which is a lot as well but that's just my guesstimate so yeah um i also do want to talk about there is a ban where you guys if you guys teleport from these two places too often you guys can get banned i think i don't know if that's a rumor or not but that's just kind of like what i've heard so don't count me on that and yeah um i also want to talk about the new set and if there is going to be a new set for valentine's day um and i know yes another new set so many diamonds we're gonna all be broke but i honestly think there might be a new set because there is there has been a lot of new sets for each update so it wouldn't be fair if there was a new set for valentine's day as well but again don't take my word for it i'm not sure i'm not a dev guys so i'm not 100 percent sure if there is going to be a new set but hopefully there could be a set but for cheap so that everyone can afford it i'm really hoping but yeah i think those are all my tips and tricks for you guys um that wanted to get some tips and tricks before valentine's day and before the valentine's day update so yeah don't forget to subscribe and turn on those post notifications so you guys can get notified every single time i post a brand new video i post videos weekly if you guys did not know don't forget to check out my socials they're going to be in the description box down below so you guys can check it out also in the beginning of my video always and yeah i love you guys so much and i'll see you guys next next week. Bye!